Hey everyone, it's me again, Kelvin. As you can see, there are two stunning dolls sharing in this box. So have a guess, which doll I gonna review today? Left or right? The answer is right. Yes, the Barbie I gonna review today is Barbie Rendezvous Masquerade Gala. Again, you might wonder why she is sharing the box with another beauty because I bought her as a loose doll on eBay. So luckily, she's still in her original style. I realized since no other YouTubers making a video talking about the quality and beauty of this doll, so I will make one today. Okay, before I focus on this Barbie Rendezvous Masquerade Gala dolls, I would like to briefly talk about the beauty on the left. This doll is one of a kind OOAK doll that I customized. She is Jennifer Lopez red carpet that I bought her as a new doll on eBay. And she is wearing this glamorous brunette brilliance by Bob McKee gown. The reason I gave this gown to this doll because I think this Jennifer Lopez red carpet look can really outshine the original doll. And it really best fits on her. And yes, the original doll got fair skin and short dark hair, which really complement with the whole red carpet style. But after I gave this girl on this Jennifer Lopez doll, I realized her brunette updos and her tan skin tone really bring out the best of this girl. The sophisticated details and colors that use on this girl enhance the scent of red carpet queen. So she is definitely dominant at the red carpet. Alright, let's move our spotlight back to this Barbie Rendezvous Mascara Gala doll. I know she can't wait out from the box so we can have a better look on her. Here she is out from the box. So based on my first impression, she already draw all my attention. Because of all the different colors used on her unique style. Mattel also released other Mascara Gala dolls and they are Barbie Illusion Mascara Gala and Barbie Venetian Opulence Mascara Gala. By comparing all these Mascara Gala dolls, I think the Illusions and Venetian Opulence dolls fashion style are more light during the Victoria era. So Barbie Rendezvous Mascara Gala fashion style is more fashion forward. I think her whole accessory style is somehow like Lady Gaga or Nicki Minaj red carpet style that we will see in these days. So the doll is actually wearing this unique and accessory colorful geometric outfit. The color used to decide this outfit which are blue, black, orange, pink, and yellow. So all these colors actually make the outfit look harmonious and also eye catching. Since I bought her as a loose doll, so she didn't come with her original handheld mask and her original black heels. But I already gave her a pair of pink heels to go with her whole style, which I think is better than her original black heels. And I'm happy with her whole style even without the handheld mask. She is also wearing this fishnet leggings which highly promoted by other big brands. I think her whole accessory style can be a fashion icon for these days. If she is not attending a mascara gala, she definitely can shine at the red carpet. Okay, let's have a closer look on her sophisticated outfit. There are three pieces of clothes to complete her whole accessory colorful outfit. And there are unique geometric jackets, bodies, and skirts. As you can see, the special cuttings and sewing techniques on this outfit really showcase the design quality of this outfit. And complete with a belt with chains of geometric shapes as deco. I just love all these small details that design on the outfit. So by comparing all Barbie signature stores in these days, all these small details they just simply use a plastic to design the door outfit such like a hard plastic belt which lack of dynamic comparing with this doll. So sorry, I'm not a big fan of plastic accessories. Let's have a closer look on her face. She is wearing this beautiful soft makeup with bright pink lips. That really complements with her whole style. 
and I really like her colorful geometric chain earrings, which are movable and fun to play with. Her unique high updo with a few color hair that really stand out on her blonde hair. This complete her whole colorful geometric look. She didn't come with any nails color, so I painted her nails in pink, blue, and black to match with her whole style. She also wearing these geometric change bracelets that match with her earrings, plus a silver ring on her another hand. I really like all these matching accessories that make her look unique and only represent her. Here's the back view of this door. So if she's walking in a mascara gala or at the red carpet, she already draw all the attention because of her colorful and unique outfit. The colors on this outfit are so bright. How can you miss this beauty? As I mentioned before, she didn't come with her original black heels. So I gave her a pair of pink heels, which I think is better than the black heels, which brighten up her whole look. Let's have a final look on this door from top to bottom. As you can see the sophisticated design on this outfit and the color use and all the accessories are the plus for her whole style. There's not a single thing I dislike about her. It's time to score the door. From 1 to 10, I give her 9.5. Based on her whole unique and sophisticated outfit, and also her high quality design, she deserves with this 9.5 marks. And since she didn't come with her handheld mask, I would say she definitely going to shine at the red carpet, or she might be a show queen who is ready to entertain her audience. If you like her ready, try your luck to search on her online. Who knows, you might find a good bargain. All right, this ends my review for today. If you like my video, please like, share, and subscribe, and i see you all next time.